Police in Kajendo County are holding two suspects linked to a vehicle vandalism racket that has cost motorists and told suffering in the last six months. The two suspects were ambushed by police officers within the Blue Sky Estate on Tuesday night. According to Kajendo Central Police Commander John Uthiambo, the two broke into homestead and vandalized the vehicle. Kajedo Central Police Commander John Othiambo said the suspects were nabbed with vehicle headlights and side mirrors, three 43-inches TVs, a laptop, two mobile phones, bunches of keys with 100 pieces, different number plate stickers with different numbers and letters, two steel metal bars and other assorted items. We have sana ni estates, especially those are the people ambaye wanaweza kuwa na ili bitu wanataka. Kama hiyo ma TV sets, kama hiyo ma computers naye wanatega aidha wakati mvua inanyesha ama wakati watu wameenda kazi na ukiangalia hapo kando iko tools yenye wanatumia kwa kuvunja na hata wakitembea hiyo macrobats wanaweka ndani ya mavuli so hata akibeba unafikiria amebeba mavuli kumbe amebeba tool ya kwenda kuvunja naye nyumba is a very strong uh, metal yenye akiingisa tu kifuli inatoka also nabbed were an assorted of crude weapons used by the suspect to commit crimes. The duo is being held at Kajado police station. Locals say the gang has caused untold suffering to the motorists in their state. Me kwa victim wa gari kuharibiwa tu hivyo mbao unaona mata. Hata kuna wakati moja tu wakati ambe ilibiwa nilikuwa tu kwa media niki complain that time. Na tunashukuru sana OCS. So hile kitu ni gependa kuuliza wanainchi ni ya kwamba wapeane information juu hawa watu tuko na wao hapa na mtu akiibiwa tafadhali awe akiripot and finally civil society actors in Kisumu are threatening to storm the offices of the security agencies over what they describe as failure by the government agencies to tame rising insecurity in the Lakeside County the activists were accusing the police of laxity even as Kisumu residents continue to agonize in the hands of killer gangs the issue of insecurity is not because waizi wamewashinda. It is because you are sleeping on your job. And we are giving you one week, seven days, if we don't see reforms and a stop to the issues of insecurity, we will be occupying those police stations. Starting with Kondele and Kasagam police stations. Those are the areas where insecurity is rampant.